Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Here we go. In today's video you will find out how the price of IOTA has changed and what the technical indicators SMA, RSI and Stochastic RSI are showing. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. Taking a look at the hourly time frame for IOTA, it can be seen that the price went down with around 2.3% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 71.2 cents. However, the volume wasn't especially high, so this move wasn't very strong. Jumping to the hourly simple moving averages, for this time interval, the current price is below all of the simple moving averages, which looks bearish and you should keep an eye on the closest SMA. The 20 SMA will play as resistance or the price will peak above the current price which is around 71.5 cents. Important to note is that the price is currently below the 200 SMA, which is can play as a strong resistance. However, breaking it decisively to the upside will signal a potential big move up. Moving to the hourly relative strength index, the current hourly RSI is at 45, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Moving to the hourly stochastic RSI, the stochastic RSI currently shows no overbought or oversold conditions, but the percent %K line is over the percent %D line, which means the current trend is to the upside. Moving to the three hourly simple moving averages, the current price is below all simple moving averages for this time interval, which looks bearish and it is to watch if the closest SMA, the 50 SMA will play as resistance or the price will break it to the upside above the current price of around 72.0 cents. Looking at the three hourly relative strength index, the current three hourly RSI is at 46, so there are currently no signs of the crypto being overbought or oversold. Looking at the three hourly stochastic RSI, we can see that the crypto is being oversold because the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the lower region. A change in the trend can be expected or for the crypto to remain at least stable for some time. However, the K line still hasn't crossed the D line, so it should be waited to see if the trend will actually change to the upside. Generally, the bigger time frames have a bigger impact on the price, so please keep that in mind when we show different time frames showing contrasting indicators. Also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching. New videos are uploaded every few hours analyzing various cryptocurrencies, so be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out. If there is something that you didn't understand, leave us a comment below and we'll get back to you. You should know that trading with cryptocurrencies is very risky and these videos are only an overview of what happens with the price and a pure technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. So you should read more and make your own investing decisions. See you next time. You next